Hello there, everybody. This is Genus London here with another episode of Super Mario 3D Land. And right over here, as you can see, I'm going through by all the levels where we um, completed. And the reason I'm doing this is because I want to show you guys that I, um, because in the videos that I did them in, hold on, in the videos that I did them in, um, I some of the levels that I, I um, sometimes um, like when I died in the level, sometimes I would skip the star coins because I died, and also not in all the levels I got the flags. But I'm here to show you that I did get all the flags and did uh, the star coins that I died on. I did show where the star coins loca the star coins locations were. I just um, like when the most of the levels where I died on, I just like forget them sometimes to get them. So I'm here to show you that uh, this is true completion. So I'll be quiet for a moment because I need to catch my breath. <gasps> And now we finally made it to the Bowser's real castle, I guess, his big bad castle, which needs 100 star coins to get, so let's get to it. Looks great. Actually, I would say this might be one of my favorite final levels in a Mario game, so let's just jump right into it, and I'm going to talk about cartoons because I do that in every episode, but hold on. Sorry about that little pause there for a second. I had to do something. Anyways, this is Bowser's castle, and I love this part where we see Bowser's big giant head. I'm already losing my breath after like we're not even ha we're not even like we just barely started this video. I'm already losing my breath, so sorry about that, folks. And by the way, this is um the second to last part of my Super Mario 3 Land finale. As we can see there, there's a fireball being shot at us, and I. Yeah, this is supposed to be a reference to the original Super Mario Bros. When um, every time you're in a castle, Bowser from the end of the room would be shooting fireballs at you. Yes, I got it. Wait, no. Okay, from the end of the room would be shooting fireballs at you. So that's kind of a nice reference to that. And just there's actually a lot of references to some Mario games in this game, and especially the original Mario Bros. There's all references to that in this game. Let's go over here and I'm trying not to move my camera that much. And I got gotcha, gotcha. Okay, and this actually this video is gonna be uh, quite short, like the last one, <coughs> because of the um, I'm doing because I'm doing half of this level in this video and the other half in the next video. So sorry if this video is too short for you, too short for your liking. Is it corn here? Get it? Okay, there you go. I okay, thought I was gonna die there, and there we go. Okay, I made it. This that, that was very short for a Mario level. And, okay. I, I have questions about this. So you see the toads are here, right? They are always kept hostage by Bowser. So how? How did they end up here and how did they open this bridge for us? You toads don't make any sense. Oh, huh. I guess by harassing the toads, we got, we got one up mushroom, so... That's pretty nice, but I didn't really need it, considering that my life count is but uh, f filled to the max. And this video is probably going to be end, like, in the next two minutes, so... There's that. And we're supposed to get these coins right over here. Get them, get them, get them! Okay, run, 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 Okay, we got another one up. So... Gotta shoot ourselves up there. Okay, so sometimes you can miss this, so you have to hit this ring, because one time... I shot myself over here, but then I actually shot myself a bit too low and died, which is pretty sad. Anyways, we gotta walk up here, and here, we finally save Princess Peach. Is there anything over here, though? No, there's nothing over there. So, see you guys next time. Sorry the, for the fact that this was a short video. Let me fix my camera a little bit. Let me make it focus.
to be continued.